Yeah, I'll look at the other two doors to see if they have. I'm not going to open them or touch them. I just want to have letters. Cool. Um, the one down here, also across the hall from where you guys came in, has a U on it. And then this one, Lorenzo, over here, the one directly south from your original position, has yep. a Z. Hey, I have a key with a Z on it. Oh, you have a key with a Z on it. Isn't that fancy? I will. Okay. Uh, hey, everyone, come over here. Let's try to open his door since we have a key. Okay. This might be a little easier than anything else. I'm game. Yeah. Okay. If you wish to I'm stack going. accordingly. Uh. I'm gonna stay a little bit, a, a little bit out of the the direct fire, but I'm also gonna throw a little bit of the uh, the honey, uh, the honey cake batter in the uh, in the entrance way that we just came in. Okay. Yeah, you don't see anything uh, disturbed at the moment. Right. And leaving a little bit, leaving a little puddle there, so that if anything steps through, little little, little specks. Okay. I'm going to uh, stick the key in the hole. And then jump backwards. <laughs> okay. You stick the key in the hole. With a great rumble, the door... <laughs> the gear rolls aside into the wall. Um, give me one second. Up. Let me update the lighting. You'd think I would have had that ready already, but... This is what happens when I have to do other things at once. At the same time. The door opens to reveal shelves. A lot of them broken, a lot of them empty. Uh, but you see jars, you see uh, sacks on the ground. Some of them look like they've been chewed through by mice and rats. You actually do see in the center of the room, uh, light falls upon revealing what looks to be fresh boxes of supplies Ooh. in the center of the room. I'm going to look around, make sure this room, if we're entering it, just kind of look in and see if there's any traps or Buckets of water, ready to fall on my head as I step inside. <laughs> All right, hold on one second. I need your perception. My perception. I am on a roll today. God damn, sir. All right. Ooh. So, uh, Lorenzo, you you get the feeling that there is oh i'm on the wrong layer still hold on you get the feeling you get the sense that there might be something else in the room off to the left okay i'm going to step back and not like the other people and kind of like point around the corner that there's something there quietly and i'm going to slowly back up I'm gonna make the gesture of, of like a trap, I mean trap, to um, to him. Um, I'm gonna say that no, it's <laughs> okay. Fingers walking. <laughs> so I, I'll uh, I'll go. I'll make the gesture of after you. Yeah. I've got my, my flange mace hunt, uh, uh, All right. honey, honey um, caked up. I'm coming on in. So. Copy that. As you step in, uh, I need initiative, please. Okay. And uh, Do you want it from everyone? Uh, I need it specifically from... Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh dear God. <laughs> Got it. Okay. Uh, yeah, I need it from Feldrickin because he's the first one in the door. Uh, Fel. Uh, actually, I don't think I should describe what happens next. Amanda? Monster! And I jump down from the rack and I jump on his back and I pulled my arms around his throat. 
<laughs> uh, hey, Amanda, real quick, you want to take a moment and introduce yourself? Welcome to the party, by the way. Hopefully they won't kill you right now. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, my name is Wookie. I'm a, a teenage um, lightfoot halfling. Um, I'm currently wearing the robes of the creepy little gnome things that are uh, habitating this dungeon. And I have like brum breadcrumbs just all over me. All right. So I've with this, gotten into the stores. Yeah. So with this, it's obvious that uh, Paul. Yeah. Oh, by the way, uh, Wookie, you're the light shining in the room. All of a sudden, you've been in darkness for so long that you find it to be like incredibly painful. Just like yeah. Oh, so you're a little dazed, but you still manage to dive on top of this great golden dragon, walking dragon that walks through, uh, and you you kind of jump on him and grab him around around the neck. And you're yelling and screaming, Paul, what you witness is uh, out of nowhere. You kind of knew it was coming, but the, it was so much faster than you expected. Uh, you have this dark uh, figure that looks very much like what you just killed in the previous room. Jump on you and gra wrap its arm around your neck. But unlike the previous ones, this one's actually screaming in common. Right. Yeah. Right. All right. So uh, <laughs> actually, I need an opposed <laughs> grapple check between the two of you. <laughs> so that's a uh, strength checks. Ron failed. Don't embarrass us. Yeah, don't lose your dignity. Dragon here. born. Dragon born. <laughs> Just right, like War good College. Start, good start. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So you you jump on his back, Wookie, uh, and then he manages to like reach back, grab you, and uh, flip you over him. And you land, uh, give me a deck save, please. Oh, snap. Okay, you land on your feet like a cat. And you've got your dagger out at the ready. Okay. Um, well, pro maybe not a dagger. It's probably my, uh, it's probably like a, a baguette of stale bread that I was eating when they came in. Got it. So you have I a baguette. Very interestingly. Yeah. You, you are wielding a baguette right now. Uh, and then you look and realize that you're wielding a baguette. And I throw it at him. Okay. <laughs> roll, roll the hit, please. <laughs> Would this I want to know, what, like wanna know a... what the damage from a stale baguette happens to be. <laughs> I, I mean, it's a stale ah, baguette. Up. I'm just saying. Should I do like an unarmed strike roll? Yeah, go for that. <laughs> it uh, you you chuck it and it hits and it literally just kind of like dink dink. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> Great. Yeah. Uh, I, I can see that this that this uh, that this creature in front of me doesn't look like the creatures we've fought, right? Yeah. I mean, give me a wisdom check real quick because yeah. let's see how fast you process <laughs> this. Yeah. I'm normally loath to encourage yep. PvP, but yep. in this case, it's yep. almost unavoidable. Not very good. Okay, so yeah, you definitely see like this is a threat. Yeah. So I'm I'm definitely gonna try and honey cake it first as it as it's over there before it can become invisible. Okay. Uh, make a make a ranged attack roll, please. He's throwing honey and flour on you so that you if you That's disappear. Ba basically, batter. That's what that means. Okay. Batter, yeah. He's uh, trying to make you delicious. Uh, ranged Invisible. attack. What would I he'll he'll cook you up too with his dragon breath. Um, do, do you want me to just roll on basically on the uh, on the mace or? Uh... Yeah, roll roll on the mace, but it's to to it's going to be to not hit her with the mace, but to fling the mixture at her. Right. Okay. All right, uh, Amanda, what's your AC? Ooh. Uh, 14. All right, you are splattered with flour and, I mean, it, 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 it's like some sort of goop. Mm -hmm. And you're like, ah, 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 and then it kind of lands in your mouth a little bit. And it's like honey and flour and water. water. And you're like, 
Mm-hmm. Like, what? Um, yeah, I just, like, start, like, looking at it, and I'm just like, why would you ruin this perfectly good dough? And then I just kind of, like, I start, like, licking it off of my hands, because I'm just kind of, like, ravenous, because I've been locked in this storeroom for, like, God knows how long. And so okay. I think I look up, like, where are the children? And then I just, like, throw back my, my hood. I'm like, I'm a child. They're attacking each other with pastries. <laughs> oh, I thought we were going to have a food fight. <laughs> uh, uh. I say, I'm a child, but if you guys are going to be rude, and I take out my dagger, I'm like, I'm very small, but I'm, I'm very fast. You should be very afraid. I, uh, we've, we've got something very strange in here. <laughs> I, uh, 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 can I enter? Yeah. As a mule? Yeah, sure. Uh, uh, as the mule? God. I, uh, look. Oh. No one's better at diplomacy than a mule. A, uh, a, a mule walks into the room. Walks into the room. I and, know what a mule looks like. I'm just, it's just confusing. This is a joke, the start of a joke. <laughs> a mule walks into an abandoned storeroom. I would like to pick up the baguette with my mouth. Uh-huh. And then I would like to transform back into human form. And I would like to say, you drop this and hand her back her baguette. Okay, you do that. And uh, you still have Earl's uh, bit in your, in your hand after you transform. Uh, Earl kind of, you know, was nuzzling up against you, and now is like, what? Well, I take Quiet. the baguette, and I, he said he picked it up while he was still a mule, I think. So I'm just, like, disgusted. He got all the slobber on the baguette. What the hell? So much waste. So much waste with this party. Well, what's going on? You guys don't look like, I don't know. You could still be bad guys, but you don't look like the bad guys. What is your name? We're trying to save the children. I'm going to motion for our, our lock keeper friend to come join everybody in the, the room. See okay, if he hold, recognizes hold on one me. second. I want to uh, just make sure that I have a token on the table for... We're not, here's 12 people in this room. Hold on. And Greg, by the way, my roll 20 is not, it's just all black right now. I've tried reloading it. It's not doing anything. Oh, hold on one second. Let me, uh, you know what? I think you're, I don't think I have assigned your token yet, but I know I gave it sight, but I don't know if it's been properly assigned. Give me one second. Let me, come on. Am I zooming out as much as you can? We're in the like bottom. The big map. Yeah. The big it's, map. A, it's a big map. Aha. Uh -huh. Got it. Can you uh, can you see them? I could. Yes, now I can. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, Keegan. Keegan comes in. Uh, a gnome wielding a crossbow. A gnome. Yeah. Does he look like one of the gnomes that? Um. That I fought? No. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay, no. yeah. As everybody comes in, I'm just like, Jesus Christ, how many of you are there? Who? <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of us. How long have you been down here? Uh, I don't know. There's not like a clock in here, so. How did you get down I've here? Eaten, like, I, I've eaten like six baguettes. So that's like the only form of, I, how long does it take to eat six baguettes slowly? How did you get down here? 
well, I don't know. Maybe you should tell me how you got down here. I don't know if I can trust you. I, I, I turn to look incredulously at Feld. <laughs> <laughs> we kind of body flopped our way down. We found a secret entrance in uh, a store above ground and followed some monsters down into it. That's how he we got here. Hmm. Sounds vaguely similar to how I got down here. But I got down here by myself because I'm really small and people don't notice me. Did you find a hole and crawled through a hole to find this area? Um, I, um, I got caught and, um, I got knocked out, uh, and whenever I woke up, uh, I killed the guy that was my guard, um, and then I got locked in the storeroom. By others? Um, no, the door kind of, like, locks itself. So I came in here and then it closed, and, um... I don't know how you guys open that thing because I'm pretty sure it's like booby trapped. But uh, but yeah, I just key. like stayed down here in the dark and ate baguettes until somebody came in. And I figured I would just kill my way out like I always do. Who are you? Okay. Do you, do you have a name? Me who I am, but nobody tells me who they are. Okay, I'll go first. My name is Wookie. Wookie, I'm Brick. The gold dragon is felled, and okay. there's the rest of them. Okay. I'll try yeah, that I, I'm bit. Lorenzo Laduti. You've probably heard of me, but uh, <laughs> is there anything inside of these uh, cases here? Just um, some water and uh, <laughs> some more bread. We found any long, square-looking. Things kind of like this. I'll hold up the key that has a Z on it. The Z room. No. Have you seen any other children key. while you've been down here? That's why we're down here. Is we're looking for all the people who've been kidnapped from the city. Did you see anybody else? Any people while you were down here before you got locked in? No, but I'm also looking for children, or you know, whatever people that look like me, people of similar age to me. I'm not a, I'm not like a child child, but you know. Are you like, looking for someone in specific or did you just come down here on your own to rescue everybody? Uh, my friend Maple went missing a while ago and uh, I thought she got killed in the month of long knives. I think that was what it was called. Um, but then her body never turned up and there's kind of like this rumor going around on the streets that uh, there's like a cult that's stealing kids. And so I thought maybe that's what happened. And um, I don't know, I'm pretty street smart. I like live on the streets. And so I just figured I would go and try to figure it out for myself since like the guards are worthless here. But um, yeah, no, I mean, I know a lot of people that have turned up missing, but Maple's like my actual friend. So I wanted to try to figure that one out. You as a member of the Alley Bashers, are you also a member of the Alley Bashers? No. I see. Can I do a perception check, Greg, and see if she's telling the truth? Yeah, uh, you guys want to make an opposed uh uh if you want to make a perception check go for it uh wookie check your whispers in a second here let me yeah <laughs> well <laughs> i think she's telling the truth guys she seems like a trusting sort of person oh nate i'm so sorry i missed your uh missed your message hold on one second okay. yes you can nate okay is he looting the bread? <laughs> that doesn't sound good. <laughs> Let me just roll this here. There we go. 
that's my role. Okay. <laughs> Better than mine. So nice, he did it twice. And got the same oh, results. Yeah, yeah, yep. That or it showed the same rule twice, I'm not sure. Oh, ho, 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 ho. He said. All right. Deception. Yeah, you guys uh, believe her. <laughs> All these secret roles going on. All right. <laughs> Oh, we're not getting anything done, guys. We're not talking to each other. We need to cool. communicate. All right. So, yeah, you, uh, yeah, you believe her. All right. Is there anything else in this room that looks pertinent or useful, or should we be on our way? I'm asking this to the group. I, I think we should probably be on our way. Wookie, we are looking for the children and those who have been taken. As I said, I am Sir Feldrickin of the Church of Helm. If you wish to go with us to search for your friend Maple and the others, you certainly are welcome. Or if you wish to go on your own, we cannot stop you, but these tunnels are not safe. Mm, yeah, I guess I'll hang out with you guys while, you know, maybe we can like help each other out. Yes. Can you guys see in the dark? Uh, some of I us can. can. Okay. Yeah, I'll go. 